Photography, you know, uh, majorly I disco I interview and speak to people that I have worked with, uh, people that have taken their pictures. You know, um, I've done PR for a lot of people. I've done a lot of things when it comes when it comes to photography. So that's what we're going to discuss today. And with me today, I have this lady right here. Let me tell you a little bit about her. Hmm? When you hear that you think, that you think. I remember, you know, having started out in the mainstream, you know, taking pictures of PDD, Madonna, Jennifer Lopez, Tom Hanks, you know, Central London. I rooted everywhere. Then suddenly, I realized that, you know what, something is missing with is missing within the African market, within the African entertainment scene. So I came in with my, you know, paparazzi things, and one of the key people that I, that, you know, took me on, that we worked together. She's with me today. And she is one and only uh, Theodora Ibekwe Oyebadi. But before I hand over, it's her royal highness. Eh? Her royal highness chief <laughs> Mrs. <laughs> Theodora Ibekwe uh, uh, Oyebade, and she is the president of UK Nollywood uh, Association. Actors Guild. Actors Guild, you see. Um, I didn't go to school. Um, <laughs> welcome. Thank you, Daniel Sink. Yeah. Good to see you again. Wow. By the way, I'm not a chief, but a queen. I rewind. <laughs> All right. Okay, let me do. All right. <laughs> That's fine. You don't know. Welcome, the one and only, right? Her royal highness, Queen Theodora Oyebade Ibekwe. Oh, Ibekwe Oyebade. That's right. Welcome. Thank you. So, how are you doing today? I'm good. You're good. The weather is good. Hey, the weather is nice today, yeah. you know. Wow, first time I'm going to be sitting with you to have a conversation. Absolutely. And to have some fun, right? Yeah. Don't take this in too serious, though. Oh, know, where's the food? There's no food, there's no drink, nothing. So what's the fun food? here? Food is not, not necessarily fun. Okay, so what's the fun here? The fun is that we're going to talk. Okay. We, you're going to take some pictures. We're going to go through memory lane. Okay. Believe me, it's going to be good. So, I like that. Theodora. Yeah. We're going to do some, let's do some a quick, serious stuff. Now, you are once an actress or you are you still acting? Once an actress, it's always an actress. So I'm an actor. I've been active since 2006 at Good News. I'm currently the president of the Actors Guild of the UK. Nollywood. Fantastic. She said something. She said, once an actress is forever an actress. That's right. Once a president is forever a president. Yeah. So she's still acting and she's producing. And now she's the president of the UK Nollywood Actors Guild. Fantastic. You know, 
here in the UK, mm -hmm. you know everything about Nollywood. You preside over Nollywood here in the UK. And that's uh, the time. It's, uh, uh, how are you finding it? What? Why did you come up with all this UK Nollywood? What? what, what? Okay, you know what, Rewan? What is UK Nollywood? <laughs> UK Nollywood. UK Nollywood is Nollywood, but Nollywood in the United Kingdom. Nollywood is a generic name for African filmmakers. Okay. And uh, anywhere you have Nollywood is a branch of the mainstream of Nollywood from Nigeria. Okay. So we are like a branch of Nollywood in Nigeria. So that's why we are called UK Nollywood. And UK Nollywood has been on for a while. There are people doing different things, acting in various productions, both in Nigeria and here in the UK and of course other countries. But you know, when we started, you know, I felt like we don't even know each other. We have to come together, build the association. I kind of founded the Actors Guild and said, we need to come together since we all have a common goal, mm. which is actors. You know, so that's why we had the Actors Guild of UK Nollywood. And I remember you asked me sometimes, what is our main objective? Okay, let me ask myself that question here. Okay. <laughs> well, in my head at the time, I wanted to bring people with like minds together, first of all, to have common goal. But the main reason is to establish a world-class production, marketing, and distribution company here in the UK because we haven't actually reached there. Mm -hmm. But I can say to you now that the Actors Guild, we've started, we've been on since 20, well, we set up the Guild since 2015, mm -hmm. actually, so that's four years now. We've done a few productions. We've done um, a series which, by the special grace of God, should be hitting a TV station before the end of the year. So that's part of the plan of establishing a world class production company. Okay. And that has taken place already. The next step is distribution and marketing. Okay. We'll be getting there. Okay. We'll be step by step. Fantastic. You know what? You know we you know we're having a serious conversation now. Absolutely. I I you know I feel like sometimes, and correct me if I'm wrong, you know, there are too many films coming out of UK Nollywood. And that is not a problem, that is fine. But some of these films, I'm sorry to say, it's not up to standard. Some, I didn't say all of it. Okay. Now, before you go further, yeah. uh, I would like to speak on that. Yes. Um, you said some. Yes. Some. Well, you may be correct, you may be wrong. Yeah. But the answer I'll give to you is Nollywood UK yeah. is a baby. Okay. Okay. We are just starting. We're only about four years old. Nollywood Nigeria started like 22 years ago. True. And when they started, where we started from, it's not even where they started from. Okay. Where they are now is where we started from. So I would say we've done a lot better than when they Because I remember I was living in bondage. Mm -hmm. It was a film that actually made people know about Nollywood. About, they used to call it home video. Everybody wants to watch home video. It was quite interesting. Mm -hmm. But then, when I go back and watch that film, and I'll be saying to myself, is this the film we watched then, and everyone was happy that Nigeria wow. was producing a film. The picture quality was absolutely <laughs> zero. It cannot be compared with what we're doing what here happen? right now in okay. the UK. Okay. So if well. you now want to compare their beginning and our beginning, we are 100% better. So in that case, yeah. I would say UK Nollywood has done really well. Okay. We are growing. And we'll get there. Okay, I, I, I agree. We have to grow in life. Yeah. You know, things have to get better. 
But again, when you say Nollywood, mm -hmm. and you say UK Nollywood, mm -hmm. personally, I think, I don't know what the viewers are, are thinking also. Mm -hmm. What is the point of having, it should we not just have Nollywood across the board? You say, okay, everybody, everything is Nollywood, so that everything will be up to standard. So it will be, you know, like, you, so it won't be a situation whereby you're saying that now, UK and Hollywood is a baby and they're growing. So why don't you just do it in a way that, okay, you know what? It's Nollywood, we have to go to the, to the standard of what Nollywood is now and even make UK and Hollywood even better than what they're doing in Nigeria. Because here, we have everything. We have light, we have internet, we have everything. They have, you, there's more resources here. So I'm thinking, is it not better to just have it like that and you as the president, you are even presiding over something even bigger than the... You, if you understand well, what I, I'm saying, I'll tell you something. Maybe first, you try and clarify that yeah, so people first, at home can understand. No, first and foremost, yeah. we are not in competition with any branch of Nollywood. Okay. But I understand what you're trying to say. Yeah. Why is it not just... It's not about UK, but it's just Nollywood. But I'll tell you something. If you have a company, sure. it's entertainment. Like yeah, thing. and then you said Sintertainment UK. Right. If you're in Nigeria, yeah. you're not going to call it Sintertainment UK. You're going to say Sintertainment Nigeria, Nigeria. Yeah, because yeah. you're on that right. platform. Mm -hmm. So we can't call it Nollywood Nigeria. We are not in Nigeria. We are right. here. Right. And then our stories right. will obviously be different from what is in Nigeria. Right. Nigeria tells us stories of what is happening in Nigeria. Yeah. We cannot, you know, makes films like that here. We have to make films in this country that will portray the, the the lifestyle of people living in the UK. Okay. She said it. Right? So yeah. I think that is a clarification coming from the president herself. Uh -huh. The Royal Highness herself. So guys, she said it. I think there's some clarification now that when you started, you had a vision. Yeah. And you are sticking with your vision. Absolutely. And, and if that's your vision, then continue to, 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 to work with that vision and, um, and continue to grow. So now, uh, as an actress, what, what has which, or what has which, what has been your, or which film has been your best that you have acted in? Or what has been your best role in a film? And what's the title of that? Okay, I would say in so many. Maybe a carnival. Yeah. Carnival. Yeah. Remember. Who was the first film? The one I covered. The first. Oh, the shape. 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 Okay. I produced the shape. Yeah. yeah. I remember that. I would say that was the best role. I would say I had. Yeah. 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 Yeah together so it was really challenging for me but i pulled it through and well till date it's one of the best movies anyway yeah. in the uk so i would say kudos to myself anyway yeah 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 yeah, kudos. So, yeah i've done a lot i've done over 50 movies wow yeah but i think that's my that that that's the one that challenged that was quite challenging to me but the recent one now we have is it's a series and it's called maze of Dockland. actually it was produced by the Actors Guild and every member of the Actors Guild featured in it. It was also challenging for me because I was actually the producer of that series and I acted in it as well. So it was not easy and it took us like, it took us like, um, mm, what can I say now? It took us like from, it took us up to eight months to finish that wow. series. Yeah, but we're doing Production so 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 that that's a series. It's right? a series. And the series yeah. is coming out. So yeah, it's coming out. So is that in the UK or also UK All over and Nigeria and and, and it across. should be everywhere across. Okay. Yeah, it so, should be aired here and in Nigeria. Yeah. Okay. So UK Nollywood now. Mm -hmm. uh, is there? Okay. Do you have Germany Nollywood? Is there, are there any other countries that have their own Nollywood? And how are you working with them? And also, how are you working with the main Nollywood? How, how, what, how, how are you working with them? How are things... You know? Any country that...
produces African film and is produced by an African, it's Nollywood. It's a generic name. So, so many countries are called Nollywood. You cannot call it Hollywood, it's not America. You cannot call it British film. Yeah. You know, because they're not British. So, if you're an African and a Nigerian to be specific, yes. and you're producing a movie anywhere in the world, okay. they will call that country your film from. Okay. As far as I'm concerned, that's what it should be. Fantastic. You know. Okay. So, you've said it. Fantastic. Because I remember the first movie, uh, the first mm -hmm. movie, uh, the, the, the Shameful Disease. Yes. The cinema was packed. I think this was 2012? 2013. Wow, this is 2013. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. The cinema was packed. Then, then, then there's another movie that yourself and Fatima Jave did. Yeah. Which was? Mm, that was Fatima's film. Yeah. Um, that's um. It's a it's a B. Oh, mm, yes. Um. Oh God, I forgot. I forgot that. I forgot. Yeah, that was Fatima's film. That's that's yeah. correct. Actually, that, actually. Um. Yeah. How can we forget? We get to know. Can you imagine? I just forgot like that. Eh? Only 2013, when 2019, six years later. <laughs> Are we getting that old? <laughs> no. We're getting old. Old age is catching up with you. But well, not me, don't bother me. It's almost six years. Don't bother me. Six years to your age. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> but anyway. Battered. Oh, yeah. Battered. Battered. You don't remember it was big. Yeah. I remember it was big. Yeah, that was produced by Fatima and Javi, Mother Bio. Meanwhile, she's doing the first lady of Sierra Leone. Now. So she, She's no longer yeah. acting for now. Yeah, you know, I want, to, I, I want to talk about that. Yeah. You know, life, I mean, like, God has a purpose. That's right. Every day. Mm -hmm. Because I remember when I met you. Yeah. You know, you were having, a, there was an event you were having then. It was so the pageant. The yeah. pageant mm -hmm. you, were, you, you had there. The elegance. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how I got to that show. <laughs> <laughs> In parking, mm -hmm. right? And then I, yeah, mm -hmm. and then I came, took some pictures, and we got mm -hmm. to the And then you took me on, you know, mm -hmm. okay, you be my photographer. And I said, hey, okay, no problem. And then you call me for events. And That's then, right. And we're then, working together. Yeah, we're working together. And you know, I, I and must, then Fatima came on board. Yeah, as well. yeah. And I, I must yeah. say something to you, though. I, I really do appreciate you. And that's the honest truth. Yeah. yeah. If you have had otherwise. <laughs> now, like, I actually do, because okay. I never forget where, where I'm coming from and how I started. Mm -hmm. Because you contributed to me mm -hmm. at the beginning, and you're still doing the same thing. You know, mm -hmm. you introduced me to Fatima. You know, Absolutely. I said, wow, amazing. Now, Fatima is the first lady. Oh, sorry, no. What do you have to say about that, really? What, what, you do know? you know what? Fatima, Javi Madabio, is one lady that I would say she's my friend and I respect her. Mm -hmm and her way of life, her lifestyle. And one thing about her is, if Fatima wants something, mm -hmm. she must get it. She must get it. The first thing she will say to me is, Theodora, the people that got it, do they have two heads? Mm -hmm. If they don't have two heads, we will get it. Mm -hmm. And she will work towards getting that thing. In fact, she has not failed in anything she wanted to do since I knew her. Before she became first lady, I'm saying this for the first time on air, she actually said to me that she will be the first lady of Sierra Leone. Yes, she actually said that to me. And I was like, what makes you think that you guys are going to win? Because then, when I met her a few years later, I got married. The same year when I got married, two months later, she met her husband. They got married as well. So we got married at the same time. You know, so and our husbands met each other and became friends and all that. Mm -hmm. And then the guy, you know, you know, was mm -hmm. now planning to to go for this uh, yeah, residency so and all that. And then, and then, she, and then she, you know, yeah. she she actually worked really hard, yeah. and I was kind of like the yeah, publicity person. Mm -hmm. You two were on board, kind of. Yeah, so we were doing publicity for them and all that. And she was in and out of Sierra Leone, and she said to me. She will make sure her husband wins. And you know, and sometimes at home she will practice how she's going to walk when she becomes a first lady. You know, we were just joking, you know, you know. And but that's why they say, out of the abundance of the heart, mm -hmm. the mouth speaketh. Mm -hmm. And when you say something, it happens. sometimes it happens. Most times, when you say something, mm -hmm. try not to 
be negative in your thoughts and whatever you say. Because sometimes when you say that thing, it happens that way. She actually said it that they would win and she would try working hard towards it. And she did. I'll tell you what, she actually worked hard. If she was not married to Mother Bill, I don't think the man would have won. I believe so too. I don't think you, you know. You know one thing. You she know so much energy in it. You know yeah. what? You know this. Okay, this is about you. It's not really about yeah. Fatima. But yeah. since we're talking about Fatima, one day, very soon, I mm. hope to get her on the hot seat. You know. But now she's very busy. I, I, I'm not sure you will get her. You have to go to Sierra Leone and get the, her. The problem is that when you call her, <laughs> you send messages. I'm like, man, I'm going, you know, I won't message on Facebook, but I understand. I haven't even seen her since she became first lady, only oh. once. I've yeah. chatted. But I have to go and meet her there. Yes. If, if, if Mohammed cannot go to her. Mountain, Mountain will go to Mohammed. Yes, sure, you know. sure. I know I, she's very busy. Yes. You know. I know when I went to, um, I went for the inauguration. Yes, you did. And when I saw Fatima, tears dropped to my eyes. Uh, you know, because I just felt, wow. See what God has done. That's yeah. life for you. Yeah, and I think I remember when we were working together. Yeah. But one thing <laughs> about us is yeah. that we were dedicated to each other. Very we were loyal to yeah. each other. Mm -hmm. You know, even sometimes there's no money, we just do it. We just do it. No, no, no. I think, wow, see what God has done. That's true. You know, and now she's she first lady. She is. She right. is. So, so amazing. For me, yeah. the only thing I can tell people with this lesson is never speak negativity into your life. Mm -hmm. And if you want to do something, do not think that anybody can stop you. It's only Almighty God. Mm -hmm. Do your best and leave the rest to God. And if God says it's your time or you get it, you definitely get it. Mm -hmm. Nothing can stop you. Yes. Work hard. Yes, and, and I mean the Bible says she actually worked hard. The Bible says it's not by might, it's not yeah. by power. Yeah. It's by his spirit, says, says the Lord. Lord. When God says it. It will happen. But you have to know what God is saying to you. And you have to start confessing it. And you have to start taking action towards it. So hey, so that's it. So now, we're going to go through memory lane in pictures. Okay. So we have the pictures ready now. <laughs> yeah, they're working on it the now. Pictures I, too. I think, uh, yeah, they're working on it. I remember them. Anybody that saying did not take photograph. Ah. <laughs> well, I could do. Oh, Everybody yeah. Everybody has to be in sync photos. Okay, so, here we go on the screen. Wow. That. Wow. That is beauty. That's <laughs> almost sexy. <laughs> <laughs> that is, that's a nice one. That was the day she received an award. Yes. Oh, you were there. there, there yeah, I received the award. 2012 now. Did you receive it? Yeah, I got an award. Okay, okay. You know, I got the best photographer award okay, 2012. Okay. And then wow. she, she got an award, but they always said she couldn't attend. Okay. You know. I didn't know you still have this picture. Yeah, it's on mine. The picture is on mine. Oh, so that's you know, interesting. Do you know what I've done? This that time I, is that I've made your online, the internet, my story space. Wow. So wow. all the blogs, yeah. Yeah, they are storing this picture. So tomorrow, you can just go and Google it. So that's you there with Omotola. Yeah. Um, that's, that's, that's. Can we have the next picture? Please. Next picture. Yeah, well, that's. that's okay, that was in that's, Manchester. Yeah, was that? When we did shameful deceit in uh, Manchester. Two in Manchester. Yeah. Okay. But, yeah, you took that one but I noticed, Theodora, you have lost a lot of weight. I have lost weight. Yeah. Yes, because I'm dieting. In fact, we'll come to that. I think I have to, you know, talk about dieting for people sometime. Because if, if you diet, <laughs> it's part of being healthy. Or getting old, you don't have to be too big and all that. You could have diabetes, you could have any kind of deadly <laughs> disease, whatever. Mm -hmm. You know, so I think it's good for people to keep fit, cut down on what you take, mm -hmm. exercise. So that's mm -hmm. what I've been doing. I've been going to the gym. And I cut down on what I take, and yeah, and it's, and it's working out. Really you look, you look hot. You look as when I came and told. Wow. I look hot. How do you know I look hot? It's only my husband that knows I look hot. You are hot. hot. Yeah. Mister Yebadi, she's hot, and I'm saying it's Daniel Singh. Yeah, you are hot. <laughs> yeah. She looks good, honestly. You look really you. good. Yes. Well done. I mean, she said something now. Be careful what you're eating. You know. You know. Just eat the right diet. You know, right. drink water, do all these things because it may not be for today, it may be for tomorrow. That's right. All right, so let's have the next picture, please. 
Na 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 to Omotola, so she just gave her. I think which award was it again? I think uh, she was honored. I know Omotola was honored, honored as, I think, uh, yeah, at the yeah. Beta Awards 2012. Yeah. Yeah. As best actress in I Africa, think, something yeah. like that. She was best honored for. Actress or something. Yeah. yeah, but then you're the one presenting the award. How, how, how does it feel to. I mean, how did it feel at that moment to present this award to Omotola? Well. Mm, well. I didn't feel anything, but ah. I was only happy because you must be she deserved it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was it was deserved, so yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that's the only thing. So I that say. that was good, eh? Yeah. All right, that's good, cool. that's good. Cool. But you know, Matola, you know what? She's done well for herself. Too. She's done absolutely yeah. amazing. And yeah. um, anything doing, anything mm -hmm. that she people see now, they yeah. see people see the show, they see the show behind it, but they're not seeing the hard work. That's and right. that is the thing about this entertainment industry. Mm -hmm. These actresses, the actors, the musicians, you know, they, they, they are behind the scenes working hard. I mean, they have families, they have, some of them are going to university, some of them are working two jobs, but yet you will never know when they come to, to acting, when they come to yeah. acting, when, when they come in front of that camera, they give the camera their best. I mean, I'm also with four children, yeah. right? grown up children. That's true. Right? Um, I mean, the last one now is in the university, you know. That's true. And then, obviously, a family, you have a family, mm -hmm. you have children, you have husband, Just you know, and together. then, you know, she's done so well for herself. She's done really um, well, yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Okay, any more picture there? Any more, any more, any more, any more. Oh, oh, oh. Who is that? Wow. Who is that? Talili, Talili, Talili. Wow, so that's sink. Talili, Talili. <laughs> Daniel, oh my god. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. 2012. Seriously, looking at myself back then and now, I've actually lost weight. Honestly, you have. Yeah. And, but I must tell you, this picture, you look so hot. And there's something about. Well, that time you are not married now. So I can talk now. Can I not talk? That is that time. But now I'm married. Yeah, that time. I'm talking about that time. Okay. This picture. Okay. Look hot. Oh my god. Look at your legs. I love that. Oh, look at anything. Oh, you're beautiful. You're beautiful. Look at me, they're standing next to you, you know. Where did I even put that jumper? Say, but I need to go and find it. I'll find Maybe that jumper. Maybe in one of the places we are taking pictures. Do you know how many jackets and jumpers I've left all over the place? Because of your passion for Because photos. I would just take off my jacket, take picture. Then I'm going home, I'm thinking, something is missing. And I'm thinking, no, I didn't need my camera, I didn't need my battery. Then by the time I get, Home, then the next day I want to go. I'm thinking, oh God, where's my jacket? It's gone. Because I left it, then I can't go back to go and look for jacket. Any more picture there? Any more? Any more? Oh, so that's you and. Oh, Ruke Amata. Oh, oh. Ruke. Was it my birthday? Yeah, that was your birthday. Ah. I think this was 2013, 14? Yeah, that's yeah. 2013. Still 2013, so that was your oh. birthday. We went somewhere, this was in. Happy birthday to This was somewhere in South London. I think it was I mean, around the Rivers and Castle Kambawe area. Oh, was it in a. Um, yeah, I think that was in a. Um, um, Kambawe. I think. Yeah. Not far from a McDonald's. There's a McDonald's. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. Yeah. I've got good memory. Yeah, yeah, See, that's true. Because I have sharp that memory, my, my photos do. That, that is true. That. <laughs> memory, man. I can always remember. That so, is true. so that's you and Uncle Ruki Amata. Yeah. Um, hopefully, she, he will also be on the hot seat very soon. Yeah. Any more picture right there? Anyone? Oh, again. Why now? It's me and again. Why me? Okay, this one was at the, at the Amina. No, premiere. it's not Amina. It's not okay, Amina. No, this was, no, no, I remember. This was at uh, the award as well. Yeah, yeah. the night that I got that award. Okay, yeah. You know, I want to say okay. something though. You people really went all out for me. I know. That award. I know. Man, yeah. everybody was Daniel Singh, Daniel Singh, even all the blogs, and I think has been nominated the every way. And that That's night true. when I won this thing, I just gave God the glory. I just felt, you know, this is not about me. Yeah, yeah. the award is good. It's, it's a physical presentation of, you know, 
the world appreciating me, mm -hmm. but personally, this gift in me is not for me. <laughs> this gift is to come and bless the world. Is to is you know to put a smile on people's faces, and I'm you know really happy. Uh, how did you feel presenting an award to me? <laughs> well, interesting, exciting, and I feel I felt happy. Because you deserved it as well, because you've really done well. Thank you so much. You've really done well. Yeah. Thank you. I really do appreciate that. <laughs> so guys, now we are going to that next session now. Where Theodora is gonna be my photographer. Okay. So I love taking pictures. Because all of you well. take a hand again, Theodora. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh Theodora, you don't love taking pictures. I do. And I tell you. I do, but I like to pose. You you don't I don't even know what to say because come <laughs> down. Oh, Theodora, you know when I first met you. As soon as you see me, then they sing. Picture. Take me. Uh, uh, take, take, me. take me. That's what. <laughs> no, 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 no. Take me. Take me. Okay. So I'm like, they don't like you. There are <laughs> other people here, yeah. Eh? I have yeah. to stop. You know, but that that's that that's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah. And one day, what I actually want to do, I have yeah. thousands and thousands of pictures of people, even some pictures that they haven't seen. So I'm thinking mm -hmm. of organizing some kind of evening mm -hmm. where we have, we have all those pictures, and people can come and select. You know, there's nothing like having the yes. memories. Yeah. You know, you know, they can come and select. They will pay for the picture though. <laughs> Don't go through. Don't go through. So, Theodora. Okay. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> you know what this is, Abby? I don't know, you will teach me now. Ah, um, no, please not to teach you. <laughs> because when I come on the red carpet, uh -huh. you teach me how to take picture. Uh, you've learned it at home before coming now. I have learned it too. Now you take my picture and I will go through it and I'll see okay. if you pass. Let's turn off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You see if you, if you pass, if you fail. So that's you. So I'm not coming on the red carpet. Hey, Daniel Sink is on the red carpet. Where you stand? All oh, right, well, why nobody stand? Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. So here I am. So you tell me how to pose, tell me what to do. Right now I'm a novice. I don't even know anything. I'm just a novice. You know, I'm just a novice. Okay, right? I'm taking now. What are you thinking? Picture? Yes. Okay. Do I look good like this? Am I looking good? Fantastic. Are you sure? Yes. So you're not going to tell me to pose or do anything? You've posed well. I'm posing well like this. Like this? See, okay. see pose. I'm just taking everything you're doing. Ah, like this? Yes. Okay. 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 You look like a clown now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Tell me when you want to stop. I can go on and Remember on. these pictures are going to Linda KG, Bella and Jazz, so you know what you're doing to the Ralph. No they problem. Don't make me look like a like a wizard or lizard or wizard, whatever you call it. Are you happy now? You good? Yeah. Okay. Hold on one second. Ah, I think our card is full. Oh, full. So brilliant. I'm gonna review that. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Theodora, the photographer. That's right. <laughs> okay. So let me have a quick glance at this picture now. Oh. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, sorry guys, you guys can't see it, but very soon we'll be able to have a system that you'll be able to see what we're seeing. Okay, so that's me. That's another one. Okay. 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 Wow, of pictures, eh? mm, no, not, Over 8,000. On this thing, yes. Wow, nice. Well, actually, you tried, I tried. At least I can see my whole body, <laughs> my head. Over eight Because some people will cut pictures like this. So if someone mistakenly deletes what is in this, what would happen? There's what? over 8,000 pictures. The thing is this, eh? with this camera... You have a backup already. Well, the thing is, there's always a backup, yes, okay. definitely. But if you mistakenly delete what's on the card, mm -hmm. you can always retrieve. Oh, okay. The, okay. There's a way to get these things back. Okay. Yes. But okay. if I'm to give you 10 being the highest, 1 being 0 being the lowest, mm -hmm. the bad thing is to get 0. Mm -hmm. For this thing, mm -hmm. I'll give you, I'll give you 4.5. I try. You try small, you try small. Stick, try. stick to your acting. Stick to your acting. <laughs> yeah, stick to your acting. Sorry. Actually, actually, man. No, I like <laughs> So, Theodora, what's yeah. new? What are you doing now? I'm just going to give you like a few minutes. Just talk. Okay. Well, you know, Nollywood. No, talk about what's Nollywood. coming up. Well, yeah, apart, apart, no, from, apart from Nollywood. Mm -hmm. uh, what about... Okay, Nollywood, how are you, okay, let me ask you, how are you empowering the upcoming, the aspiring actress, actresses and, you know, actors? How is Nollywood UK? You know? Well, the, the first thing I would say is, um, um, 
seminars have been put in place for them, the master class and all that, to empower them and teach some of them that hasn't got idea of what acting is about. Mm -hmm. Two, before they even have that, they need to sign up with Actors Guild, become a member. Mm -hmm. uh, when training is taking place, they will be part of it. Mm -hmm. And when we are filming, as we are planning to have a world-class production, marketing and distribution company, they will not be left out. So those are the things to do. Join us, join the Actors Guild, send me a message on Facebook or on Instagram, or you can email me. My name is Chidora Ibiqui, anywhere, anytime in the world, with no change. Just go to my Facebook, Instagram, Chidora Ibiqui. I want to be a part of the Actors Guild, and I'll tell you what to do and all that. I'll okay. we'll take you from there. But remember, if it's your passion, go for it. Let no one tell you that you cannot do it. You can do it if you really want to do it. Yeah. You know? That's well, what happens. <clears throat> I said it, so. Yeah. If you want to get into, you know, acting, you want to, you know, you want to express yourself through, you know, acting. Well, your start, you know, and I think you have some support around you. So, you know, at Facebook, if you don't know her directly, you will know somebody that knows that knows. Mm -hmm. If you mention Theodora Ibeku in London, here yeah, or in UK, here, yeah, hardly would any African person say, not just Nigerians, say they don't know her. So, you know, I think. Um, Yes, um, I think we've had, I've had a very good conversation with the other people. Thank you. And, you know, all I can just pray is that God continue to strengthen you. Amen. You know, I believe that God doesn't just do anything anyhow. God has a purpose and a reason for having you here in the UK. And he has a purpose and a reason for having you as the president of the act of... Act of there's a purpose for it. Right? People will like it, some people will not like it. Right? You cannot please anybody. Everybody. That's your honest truth. Mm -hmm. You know, I no. There's this thing I I I, I, I just been thinking about this thing. There's, there seems to be a lot of disagreement and this person fighting that person, that person fighting this person. What is going on? <laughs> Can you share light on this? You know, and is there anything you can do as a president to try and, you know, just bring peace between two people, three people, you know, as a president? No, but people fighting is, is normal with life. Even even Nollywood, Nigeria, even when Adora was there, she said it, you know. Mm -hmm. So it happens. It's not different from what's happening in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. It's human nature. You know, we're not born with, uh, from the same parents, obviously, we're bound to disagree at some point. Mm -hmm. So it's something that is normal anyway. But as a, as a member of the GIS, um, one, of the, one of the objectives of that GIS as well is also to, you know, you know, settle dispute between members, especially not only members, but if they have problems on set, mm -hmm. they bring it on to the meeting and we'll have legal advisors and all that. And they settle them. So, but I would say anything that has to do with people quarreling, it's just human nature. It's natural. People can always agree to disagree, disagree to disagree, whatever. You can't always agree at some point. You know, so it's just it's just normal. Okay. Yeah. Well, I know it's normal to fight, but what I'm trying to say is, you know, sometimes there are some fights that yes. you as a president need to settle. Yeah. You understand? There are mm -hmm. some that. You know, um, uh, it's within your. Yeah, we, we've done we've you know, done that in the past anyway. We've mm -hmm. done that, but um, you can force a horse to the river. You're not going to force a horse to drink. I water. agree. You try your best to settle them. If and people you decide do. not to work with each other, there's yeah. nothing you can do about that. Yeah. You know. Yeah, right. For instance, like me, I can't work with everybody. True. I'm right. an individual as well. Yeah. Even if I talk to you, you're my friend. You know. It does not mean I have to do business with you. I agree. You know, so. I agree. Fantastic. I love that. You see, she has said it. I like her. She said this as it is. I don't have to do business with you. Yeah? That's right. Go and jump in the room. No, I'm only playing you. She didn't say that. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm going to round up with this. This is my empowerment session now. You know, a lot of time people hurt us. People say things that they're not supposed to say. Uh, people just do things to bring us down. That's right. But one thing I have learned over the years is not to allow people's 
action towards me to make me to react up to a point whereby I don't even now I don't know what I'm doing. You know, the most important thing in life is to forgive. We must learn to forgive. You know, if you, if you go to the uh, the lost prayer, right? We must forgive. You know, and and you know, it's something that we have to do so that we can be sane, not insane, no. So we so so that we can please God. You know, we have to learn to settle scores with the, with those people that have, that has hurt us. You know, if you know that somebody has done wrong to you. Don't keep malice. Don't think, oh, he did this, he did that. I will not talk to them. I will do this, I will do that. No. Right? Let us learn to forgive. Because when we forgive, our Father in heaven will forgive us. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you. From your boy, one and only, Daniel Singh. Thank you so much. Theodora. You're welcome. And I, I, I hope. Uh, maybe the next, I don't know, maybe in the next few months I'll have you back. No problem. On this seat, discussing uh, Nollywood UK making the first film to make one million pounds. In Jesus' name. In that Jesus will come name. to pass. Please do. And I'll be a photographer, Shibi. That will be the one. That will be Exactly. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> All right, thank you guys. Later. Bye. So we pay or do I have a wire bone? Maybe give it to you, Lewa. And who fetch it? Who fetch me more? I got to battle one for the year. Who baffle the year? Who she got crab? Who jet by last day? Full group LD. Happy gems, yeah, my boy. Yeah, we got all the yo, yeah. Daddy, my yo, oh, yeah. Ni gba ti mo ti ni Happy Gems Farm. Ni on gogo ti di irorun. Happy Gems Farm be bawo. Ni Happy Gems Farm on gogo irorun lo bade nsi aji eleyin fe ni. Ko Christ tabi boilers. Si o to bi to de ni alafia. O mu e lo be lori sirisi to ma toto ko ro dorodo. Tata si to nre dodo. Sombo to jo mo shobolo shobolo. E ja ran tutu ati gbigbe. Fresh from farm. No preservation rara. Kai mu gbadun e. Ko ko na aji ye yin ati sisun. Lori sirisi fo awon le lo nje igbalode. Nla lati kereje kereje iye restaurant ni Happy James Farm and when you are to to be bonku bonku fun gbogbo awon lara tuta ati awon to ba fe ra iye yo iyen ni great ni great aye tun wa lati je alagba ta won e pakasun won rewa october o si dara lenu o nsa lo re pelu Happy James Farm mo ta omi mo lori sirisi o tun ni ile ise bakery gbalode e se lu to ba woni mo se le ri won wo wa losun wo wa ni ibadan won se home delivery pelu bibikibi ti e ba wa won gbe gbogbo ti e ba fe wa fun yin onu le ise won wa ni oni re ke village Long ago, share off the way to read. It will be local government beside Osun State University. Tabi ke konsu olore raye lujara. Sales at appyjamesfarm.com. Tabi ke kwa osere rabani soro yi. 0814-009-7878 at 0708-138-6770. Belu 0701-766-6010. Happy James Farms. All to you, yeah. Jerusalem, and of glory, Jerusalem, holy land, and a visit to Jerusalem. These are the things that have been written, and we are bearing witness to them as being true. This is an opportunity for you to visit Israel, Mount Nebo in Jordan, the ground where God spoke to Moses, showing him the promised land and the holy land of Jerusalem. Ten days visit to see for yourself the places which you have read in the Bible, like Ella Valley, where David defeated Goliath, Mount Nebo, Sea of Galilee, Canaan, where Jesus turned water to wine, River Jordan, where John the Baptist baptized Jesus.
Jesus Christ, Joseph and Maria House in Nazareth, Jericho, the Dead Sea, the Garden of Gethsemane, where Jesus prayed, Lazarus' tomb, King David tomb in Jerusalem, the house where Jesus and his disciples had their last supper, the Pentecost upper room and so on. Our office is at Albert Basins, South Dockland, London, E16 7QY. For more info, please visit www.holytrinitypilgrimage.co.uk or please call Captain Mother Hassan on 078-721-37953 or Pastor Elijah Kamui on 79 846 34898 or email us info at holytrinitypilgrimage.co.uk A pilgrim is not a tourist. The tourist sees sights and returns home the same person, but the pilgrim gains insights and returns home changed and spiritually fulfilled. Jerusalem. My people in London, when I don't hear about AHA TV, they don't come with something new. All them Boku Gladi Gladi where they happen in London. AHA TV get different camera for Una business then. Not to just gentleman and woman no more for take fine picture. You self can look good na camera. And it don't matter whose partner the world where you tap. AHA TV, they take picture. We're gonna make you enemy then shame. You family and friend then go call eh? Because AHA TV, we get the best. For any kind of business where you get, like birthday, christening, wedding, church or mosque business, and even burying, AHA TV na the master. AHA TV, we then at the heart of London. And we get the best technology in our studio in Ontario. You can call we any time na this number, 020 800 46 100. Or you can email we na info at ahatv.co.uk. But wait, oh, you can call we na the mobile self, 0734 123 4560. AHA TV. We no go let you go. 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 Day Care is an Ofsted registered childcare provider in Erith, Slade Green and London area with several years of experience in childcare services. We are open 7am to 6.30pm Monday to Friday. We offer free 15 to 30 hours government funding for 2, 3 and 4 year olds. All our staff are highly qualified, first aid trained with child protection awareness. We offer pick up from home and drop off back home and we are flexible to meet parents needs. Just a quick call on 013-226-35268 or 078-077-29720 or email info at happygemschildcare.co.uk or visit our website www.happygemschildcare.co.uk